Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. 200 years ago today, March 12, 1816, a group of women called a meeting at the home of Mrs. Samuel Davis for the purpose of organizing and sponsoring a charity school for the benefit of the less privileged children in Natchez. The War of 1812 and its associated Indian battles coupled with recurring yellow fever epidemics had left many widows and orphans in Natchez and the area. The women, who call the new association the Female Charitable Society, quickly moved to provide residential care as well as education. Today, that organization is the Natchez Children's Home Services, recognized as the oldest nonprofit agency in Mississippi and among the oldest continuously operated agencies of its kind in the United States. For 200 years, Natchez Children's Home Services has been supported almost entirely by the generosity of families, businesses, and individuals in the Natchez community. Today, the need for programs and services for neglected, displaced, and at-risk children is as great as it was in 1816. The long-ago founders of the Natchez Children's Home Services were convinced that God's work was in their hands. That same conviction drives the efforts of our organization today. I'm Nancy Hungerford, Executive Director of the Natchez Children's Home Services, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.